morning and happy Monday. Welcome to a new work week in my life. My name is Lexi. If you're new here, I'd love it if you subscribe, stay a while, it's a fun time. I am fully ready in my scrubs and ball of sneakers. It is my last week in Gainesville for a residency and then we go back home to our home base the office and residency that I will be at for the next two years in Naples and I'm so excited to get back and start seeing patients and just get everything rolling. It's basically gonna be like starting over again. Meeting everybody, finding my office, meeting the assistants, everything. So, very excited about that. But until then, we are here for another week. I am drinking the iced coffee that I have at home. You guys would be proud of me. I just made like a little cup of it and I've been drinking that. I'm just wearing the blue scrubs, my hair in a little bun, all of that jazz. Did my nails last night. That's about it. So I'm going to pack, I think, two Lunchables. They were buy three, get three free you saw in last week's vlog. So I'll pack like a pepperoni cheese cracker one and then a pizza one. I need to put deodorant on before I forget. And we'll get on the road. We have full day of lectures today. I'm pretty sure we have lectures in the morning, lectures in the afternoon. I'm gonna stay there for lunch, get some video editing done, hopefully. That's my plan. Find somewhere to eat, chill, relax. And we'll see where the day takes us. Bachelor's on tonight, but I don't know if we're gonna watch it tonight or we decided we might all watch it tomorrow on Hulu or something. I was supposed to possibly do a Zoom with my dental school friends, so we will see if we all catch up tonight or not, but lots of computer work to do. I have to edit a podcast this week, edit multiple videos, make content for brands. Very busy week, so come along this week in my life. It's Monday morning. I really need to go, and I am tired, so... Back home now in my new Janu Ultralight Scrubs because I have to take some content for them. I just grabbed some chips and chicken wing dip to snack on and then the Liquid IV Energy drink. Today was a long day of lectures, but I am going to snack, chill, um, put on little wires and like decompress from lecture and then formulate a game plan from there. I have to redo a couple nails that messed up. Um, it's my fault. I just didn't let it cure all the way yesterday, so a couple nails have to be redone, but I'll do that after I eat. Finish editing, um, catch up on the lectures from today, like putting them into that Word document, and just sort of chilling. And then if I have time, I want to do some laundry over at my friend Juliana's apartment. So I might go do that. Also, but right now, I just need to chill, eat some snacks. I feel like I'm younger again, and when I used to come home from school, like I used to just like need to eat and then do my homework, and that's kind of what it feels like again, even though now it's work. And everything's just gonna be so different. We got our schedule for next month for back in Naples, and I'm so excited to just like get started. I feel like I've said that a million times, but I'm just very excited. I'm really trying not to freak out right now. I have literal chest pains. I just went to start editing our next podcast episode and it's been a couple weeks since I've done like the editing process since Gabby and I batch recorded a few before residency started. So I didn't notice this before, but my entire folder full of the podcast jingles, the intro music, all of our ad reads, our briefs for the ads, all of our graphics and branding and logos. The whole folder's gone. I'm guessing I must have accidentally moved it to the trash when I was clearing out, like, I don't know, like things that were downloaded on my desktop, like lectures and things like that that I didn't need or stuff for videos and I must have put it in the trash and I clear my trash all the time because I need to make room for more footage when I'm editing and I, I've i checked everywhere. I can't find it. I've checked my external hard drive in case I accidentally put it there. The whole folder is gone. It's just missing. And it's been a month since I needed it. So I have no idea where it is. I was able to re-download the jingles from other episodes. Like I was, I cut the jingles from old episodes on GarageBand, but I'm literally have it like I have chest pains because I'm so stressed that like all that stuff is just gone. 
so I'm trying to salvage what I can. I just feel like my mind is moving like a mile a minute right now and I have a million things to do and now this just feels like another thing that like I can't get done or it's gonna take like way longer and I could cry. So if you're having a stressful Monday, know that you're not alone. And I'm really trying to like keep my cool, but I have literal chest pains. Like I am so stressed right now and this may not seem like a big deal and it really in the grand scheme of things, like it isn't. There are many worse problems out there, but it's just like when you're already stressed about getting something done and then something makes it 10 times harder for you, like you know that feeling. I cannot be alone in this. And like little things pile up all day and you just want to cry. That's currently where I'm at. Still trying to relax, but I decided to make some food. So I'm making that voila, like garlic chicken, veggie, pasta meal. I don't know. I also don't have a measuring cup here. So I just like eyeballed the water that it said to add. Uh, uh, nothing is going right. I literally can't even get like the podcast footage that Gabby and my mom recorded to input into GarageBand. It's now going to take me so much more time. I don't mean to just sit here and complain, but I feel like... I wanted to show the good, bad, and ugly, and having this full-time job of residency while also trying to do like my social media stuff in a house that doesn't really have Wi-Fi, in a place that isn't my home, it's just all starting to like really catch up to me, and I'm just getting very overwhelmed, so. <sighs> the internet isn't real if it looks like everybody always has their stuff together and everything. You know, the grass is always greener, just know that Everyone has freaking bad days. And I'm having one of those today. <laughs> Great. And then, the, yeah, we couldn't They used like their own speakers and something was not hooked up right and you could not hear anything. So I don't even know if they were good or bad because we really couldn't. All right, I got the podcast up. I got my video edited and it's uploading right now, but it's been sitting at a solid 4% for like 20 minutes. So I don't know how much of this video is gonna get uploaded tonight, but I need to go to bed. It's like 11 p.m. already. I need to brush my teeth and go to sleep. I'm very tired, but got a bunch of social media work done tonight. So tomorrow I can focus on like getting the study guide up to date and things like that. I'm so tired. I can't even form coherent words. So I hope you guys are enjoying this work week in my life so far. Happy Monday. It is done. Hopefully tomorrow is a better day. Good morning and happy Tuesday. It's 7.30. I don't know if I wanna chance it, but I really wanna to go to Starbucks, so I might run really fast, get a nice coffee, and then try to zoom and make it to lecture by eight. Cross our fingers, we will see. I haven't fully decided, I'll decide when I get in the car. But in my scrubs, ready to go. I'm gonna bring a clear elastic and do those like little braids again, but I'm gonna do it like while I'm in lecture. It'll so happy Tuesday. Same old, same old. I'm gonna pack Lunchables for my lunch. Literally nothing new. Let's go. I'm very tired, but we're gonna fake it till we make it. High energy till we wake up. We're playing with fire, y'all. Hopefully it's ready. I mobile ordered. Got the goods. Tall vanilla cream cold brew, my new fave. And it is 7.42, so... So far, so good. I just have to quickly make the drive and then hope that we find parking. But this was necessary today. It's going to be a long day. I just followed her. I was like, I'm going to go grab her. Beautiful. So much better. No more electrical hazards. What do you do with cords? Like, when can you do some? Following the linings on your cheeks. Because, baby, in your absence, life is boring. So I never leave. I 
did my hair this morning during lecture. I realized I never showed you guys, but been loving the two braids into low buns. I'm gonna change out of my scrubs, put on just a t-shirt and shorts. Might go get a snack. I'm kind of hungry. I don't know what I want. It's only three o'clock, so I don't really want to make dinner yet per se. Um, I'm gonna go over to one of my co-residents' house to watch The Bachelorette from last night, uh, like 7:30. So it's three o'clock now. I'm gonna spend the next few hours getting some serious work done, making my study guides for the lectures and just catching up on all of the resident boot camp stuff. I also have a couple of social media things to do. Um, I have to edit a reel, all of that jazz, just like getting my to-do list done. You guys know the drill by now. So I'm gonna go change, chill, put on pretty little wires while I do all of that, of course and I'll check back in. So I leave on Friday right after class and I just looked in my fridge and I have enough food for lunch tomorrow, Thursday, Friday, and dinner tomorrow, Thursday, but not tonight. And I don't feel like going to the grocery store and honestly, I'm just being lazy, but I have the Grubhub Zero Delivery. So I was like, you know what? Let's try a local Gainesville restaurant. So I'm trying a Greek place and I got a beef gyro bowl with like rice. If you guys have been watching for a while, you know I love the one in Buffalo. And it sounds good, it's not too unhealthy, so I figured why not. So I just ordered that, but I figured I would chat while I got my laptop and stuff out because I get a lot of questions lately in the past couple vlogs, like how many years is residency? Like I thought you got into a program in Naples, what are you doing in Gainesville? Why are you in classes? I thought you were done with school and just working, so. I also wanted to pop in right here and remind you that any thoughts, feelings, opinions, and sponsorships are solely my own. And as much as I love my job, I am going to keep that very separately from my YouTube videos in the sense of everything that goes on behind closed doors, like seeing patients, things like that. Obviously, you guys know that I can't show any of that. So as much as these are fun and I love to vlog week in my life, I just want you to know that work is my priority and it comes first and everything is separate from any affiliations with that. I figured I would chat with you guys while I get all of my stuff out. Basically, I did. My program is through University of Florida. It is the pediatric dental residency. It is two years. I graduated dental school back in May. So I went right into residency. Um, I do get paid. So it is work. I'm working. I'm not paying to go to school anymore like I was in undergrad in dental school. And the way this program specifically does it is there is a UF Gainesville and a UF Naples program. I'm in the Naples one. I applied to the Naples one. I didn't apply to the Gainesville one. And the first month, so basically like the whole month of July, you are in like residency boot camp and you're basically in lectures all day. Some like hands-on lab work, like as far as like typodonts and mannequins and things like that. You're taking pedo core classes and sedation core classes. So it's a whole mix of stuff that we're learning. But basically we have two exams in August when we get back to Naples. Um, they're like very long, handwritten, things like that. But so I have been in Gainesville. I subleased an apartment. Um, so our classes are on the dental school campus and taught by UF faculty. It's been so great. We've been with the Gainesville residents and they're the best. I'm gonna miss them when I'm gone. But basically on Friday, I leave this apartment that I'm subleasing, drive home where Sean, my pets, where you guys have seen me living in Southwest Florida. And on Tuesday, we start like normal clinic orientation and then I'm starting to see patients on Wednesday. So it's a little bit confusing, I get that. Um, but starting next week will be more of like eight to five, go to the office, have you know patients all day, like actually doing dentistry on patients sedations, OR, things like that, on call, all of that good stuff. So that'll start next week. I don't know why I'm talking with my hands so much, but I wanted to explain that. If you have any questions, comment. Um, every pediatric program is different, obviously, but that is why I am in Gainesville right now. However, that ends on Friday and we start our normal residency. I get to meet the second year co-residents in Naples, which I'm super excited about. I get to see, you know, the operatory and the facilities and meet the assistants and the faculty there. And I'm super excited about that. So, like I said, I'm gonna work on my study guide. I've got Pretty Little Liars on my iPad here. 
that I'm gonna watch while I do that. And it says my food should be delivered between 3.56 and 4.06. It's 3.23 right now. So let's get to work. This looks so yummy. In just sweats and a t-shirt, and then I'm bringing laundry detergent and my dirty clothes over to my friend Elizabeth's house. All of us female co-residents are gonna watch The Bachelor at her house, so she is kind enough to let me do laundry over there, so I'm gonna bring this with me. Um, finished the study guide from today, so that's good. I am just feeling so lazy, but I need to get going. We said we'd meet there at 7.30, and it's like already 7.15. I am also extremely dehydrated and so thirsty. So we're gonna keep drinking water, but let's go. The wrong decision. Obviously this is a fresh new week. Yeah. No, I'm all defending you guys. Yeah, Power Rangers. No. Power Rangers. What is that? Who are you? That's not Tremaine. <laughs> It is way later than I wanted to be home, but I was just having such a good conversation with my co-residents and I did all my laundry. So I'm gonna <laughs> quickly put that away and brush my teeth and go to bed. It is almost midnight, which is insane for me. And I am so tired, but I had so much fun and The Bachelorette was insane. I was very bored the first two episodes, but this third one was, it was something else, so. We'll see how the rest of the season goes, but I really enjoyed it. It was my last bachelorette night in Gainesville. Tomorrow's gonna be a long day. So, we do have a lecture in the morning, lab in the afternoon, and then a review session at five. So it's gonna be a very long day. So I need to get to bed. So I will see you guys tomorrow. I'm gonna put my clothes away and go to sleep. <laughs> Good morning vlog and happy Wednesday. I slept through my alarm, so that's why I'm starting the vlog on my phone. It's 7.45. I woke up and looked at my phone and it was 7.39. 7.39, we start at 8 o'clock. So I made it out the door in six minutes, which is why, I mean, honestly, I look like this every day. So I can't say which is why I look like this, <laughs> but kind of. Um, uh, I was like actually planning on like getting up, getting there early, charging my laptop. I literally slept through my alarm. I have no recollection of turning it off. I guess it's amazing that I woke up at all at 7.39 and not later, but yeah. So happy Wednesday. We have lecture at eight. I'm gonna move this over. We have lecture at eight and it's 7.46. I am driving to the parking. I think I'm gonna be okay as far as timing goes, but absolutely no coffee. I threw random stuff for my fridge in my lunch. Yeah. This is gonna be an interesting day. I still feel like I'm like not awake. Could really use a coffee. But here we are. It's Wednesday, we have lecture this morning, lab in the afternoon, and then a review, which uh, I forgot. I wanted to bring extra food because I knew we'd be here longer than normal because of the review. Oh, uh, what a mess, what a mess, what a mess. Maybe I'll have time to run home, I don't know. Today was brutal. It was just a really, really long day. And we just had a review, so it's 6.45 and I'm just now getting back to the apartment. Um, you saw this morning I slept through my alarm, so that was like a great start to the day. And then I tried to call the utility company for this apartment during lunch and I was on hold for an hour, so finally I gave up. Then I just tried to call now and they're already closed, so I'm just like, the review also stressed me out a lot. I feel like I am struggling to like memorize like sedation drugs and things like that, but so basically, after review, I printed all of my notes out. I printed all of my notes out. You guys know those 
like basically they're just like word documents of the powerpoints but i printed them out <laughs> it's quite hefty and then i went to walmart and got a binder and a hole puncher and i'm gonna sit here i have a glass of fruity wine with a lot of ice in it but i'm gonna sit here drink this hole punch my notes organize them in the binder and watch Pretty Little Liars, and then it is go time. Not so much as studying tonight, because last night I did a lot of the, like, updating my study guide and school stuff, so tonight is social media work. I'm struggling to balance it all. Just like this week, everything's a little bit crazy. I'm so grateful that I do have, like, brand deals coming up and things like that, but I'm a little bit stressed because I feel like my life is so chaotic and, like, balancing everything. I know it's going to be you know, a learning curve and it'll get better as we go, but a little bit stressed, who's surprised? Um, so yeah, I'm gonna, like I said, we're gonna punch these notes, get them organized in a binder, so at least that's one thing done, and then we'll get to work with organizing our life, and I'll show you guys maybe a little bit of behind the scenes of like answering emails, brand deals, looking at what my managers put up, things like that, because I feel like that could be a fun switcheroo from the dental content that you've been getting in this vlog. <laughs> Living days in the night Living in your arms as it's gone by It's easier to find oh, oh. Just made a Totino's pizza Finished hole punching everything It was quicker than I thought So I'm gonna eat And then it is computer work time Alright, it's much later It's already 10 o'clock um, I did a lot of social media work So I made this reel for Janu a day in my life as a pediatric dental resident. I just started residency, so we are in Gainesville, Florida for boot camp this month. Popping on my Janu scrubs. You guys know they're my favorite, especially the ultralight fabric being in Florida. You can't beat it. Drinking my iced coffee in the morning, and I know I'm 26. So go follow me on Instagram to see the rest of that. But So I made that. I edited some brand photos for Black Bow Swim. And then I had to answer emails. So I answered emails regarding selects, which is like when you work with a company or a brand, you pick out like the items um, from their website. So I did that for a couple brands. And then I had to do like random stuff, like set up my online prescription identification thing for work. Uh, what else did I do? Uploaded some clips for vlogs onto my computer. Just like random stuff like that. So, my mom just sent a text. Just watched first episode of Terminal List. Holy crap. Crazy. Yeah, that's a show that Sean just finished, but he wants me to watch with him when I get back home. So, we'll start that soon. But it is 10 o'clock, I need to shower and wash my hair, so I am gonna go do that so that I don't have to do it in the morning. I'm gonna set three alarms tomorrow morning since I very clearly slept through two somehow today. I have no idea how, I have no recollection of turning them off. Um, and I'm super thirsty. So, I'm gonna go shower and get ready for bed. Brush my teeth, I wore my retainers last night so I don't have to do it tonight, which is phenomenal. And that's about, that's about it. That's my evening. I'm getting a little stressed because I'm looking around and like, yeah, I don't have that much stuff here and it'll realistically take me 30 minutes to pack it up. But I'm like, oh my gosh, tomorrow's already Thursday. I think we might get together as a group one last time. Possibly tomorrow, I don't know, but I wanna be like fully packed up tomorrow night and like load up my car and then I have to figure out this furniture because the girl I'm subleasing from isn't coming back and she's like you can do whatever you want with the bed the desk and the organizers over there like that stuff and I put it on Facebook marketplace but I haven't gotten any bites and honestly like I didn't purchase it so I'm down to give it away for free I just think I'm gonna need help like actually getting it out there um so yeah I gotta figure that out Hopefully I can employ the help of my co-residents to maybe help me Friday during lunch, but I want to be fully packed up so that way Friday, as soon as class is done, I can hightail it back down. I can't believe the month is almost over. We literally have two days left of boot camp in Gainesville, and then 
the real work starts and I'm so excited to like get into a routine at home and actually like start seeing patients and all that. So I'm gonna stop babbling. I'm going to shower and go to bed. Take a shot every time I do a peace sign. I feel like the last couple vlogs, I'm just like every five minutes. So today we are in the medical school sim lab doing like, it's our sedation class. So I'm assuming it's gonna be like rescue when things go wrong type thing, like CPR. I don't know. We'll certainly see. Maybe inserting an airway. But, very tired. Just popped on my sneakers. I just have my hair in these twists into a bun. I'm struggling with my hair lately. Maybe it'll be better once I'm back home and have all my stuff, but I am, I don't know what I'm gonna pack for my lunch today. I think I have a Lunchable left. I also have leftovers from the Greek restaurant, like very few, but, and then I have like a sun-dried tomato goat cheese that I could bring with, um, like little bread crackers. I don't know. Very tired. I'm very thirsty. I need like ice water this morning instead of coffee. Let's head to school. No, I keep saying that. Let's head to work. Today was payday, so it is work. I don't know what's happening with these side pieces. The other day I had my hair in a low ponytail and Sean told me I looked like the drummer boy from the Revolutionary War and he was so accurate and now that's all I see when I do my hair. This is tragic. <laughs> So I'm home from work, change of plans. I'm getting rid of the furniture tonight and staying with my co-resident, Elizabeth. She offered her guest room to me tonight, which is so sweet, so that I can pack up tonight and just go back home to Southwest Florida tomorrow. So I'm currently in the process of figuring out how to get this twin bed from where it was in here out to the living room so someone from Facebook Marketplace can come buy it. I'm sweating. I got it pretty far. I'm doing like an okay job, but we're stuck here like this. It's currently wedged. Then I have to pack and we'll come back and we'll figure that out. Bye bye Gainesville apartment. It's all empty. Just picked up some pizza and I am headed to Elizabeth's house with the food. All right, it's bedtime. I will try and get some clips tomorrow, the last day of boot camp, and then we make our drive down to Naples. Good night. I am exhausted. Hello and happy Friday. Today was a chaotic day. It was our last day of boot camp and I'm in my car. It's 2.45 p.m. and I am heading home to Naples. I'm very excited. I'm sad because I'm definitely going to miss the Gainesville residence, but I'm ready to be home. My car is full of my stuff, all packed and ready. Let's start the drive. It says I'll be home at 6.19 p.m. We'll see about traffic, but I think I'm going to end this vlog here. So I hope you guys have enjoyed the work week, work week in my life in Gainesville, but now it's time to head down south and start in clinic in Naples, and I am so excited to be home again. Why don't we go ahead and start the drive and I'll see you in the next video. Nothing like your smile in the morning Following the linings on your cheeks Cause baby in your absence life is boring